Alrighty. Let's go this way. There's my toolbox. Let's put some things away. Put items away. I'll keep my weapons. I don't need you. Hm, toolbox is full too. I mean, I don't really need any of these items, so we'll just forget about it. For those that are saying that my Holy machine gun has infinite, well, I'll finish that in a moment. Did you need something? No, I was just passing by. I didn't think anybody else was here other than Polly. The door opening like that just, it surprised me, that's all. That guy's creepy. Why does he have a plant with red leaves? I don't know, it's also in the same shape as that symbol. The upside down piece thing. Uh huh. Nice to meet you. I travel a whole lot, you see, selling tree saplings. Just the usual salesman doing the usual road trip. Sometimes I feel, I don't know. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. I get it. You're the special agent Scarface that everyone's. Special Agent Scarface? I'd need a bigger scar to live up to that name. Call me York. That's what everyone calls me. What? <laughs> you got it. York. Is this your first visit here, then? No, sir. Actually, I've been coming here once or twice a year for oh, a while now. I don't get much business here, but it sure does make a fine vacation. If you want to go I on mean, vacation, it's a gorgeous yeah. hotel at a bargain price. It's so relaxing in these parts, too. Oh, I just love all the nature. I feel so relaxed here. Doggy. <laughs> Say hi to Willie. Oh, don't worry. He's a good boy. Do you like dogs? Hey, Willie. How are you doing? <laughs> Pretty smart, too. Oops, before I forget, let me give you this. It's just a sample of what I said. Uh, thank you. How kind of you. Okay. <laughs> so where to get that where one from? The FBI out here. <laughs> Sounds like more than just a vacation. A murder, actually. The perpetrator is still out there. Try to stay indoors at night and during the rain. We want to prevent it from happening again, okay? Oh, it's a darn shame. Places like this used to be the safest in America. Could I ask you something? Do you know a lot about seeds? Seeds? Gardening, huh? You don't look like a green thumb, but let me tell you, though. You know, once they sprout, you don't need to do much. You can leave it be, and why, it'll turn into a big tree no matter what happens. Kind of like those stocks that politicians buy that just keep growing and growing. Well, you just wait and see. This town is gonna love them. <laughs> right. We were just about to go take a morning stroll, so I'll get going. Good luck now with that case. Thanks. Zach. Do you remember what the coffee said? Forest Kaysen. F. K. Woo! <laughs> this show has just begun. <clears throat> something interesting going on here. But yeah, for people who were saying that my machine gun has infinite ammo, I don't think it does because the handgun has a little infinite sign there and the machine gun doesn't. It has an actual number for ammo. I just think I have a lot of ammo. But I could be wrong. All right, where is my next objective? Are you gonna tell me? Let me look at, see if I can tell on my map. Ah, 
So there's things in here that I need to do. I'm not supposed to leave yet. Well, let's start going through the rooms, I guess. Thought that dude came down here, but I guess not. <clears throat> let's go in here. Hello. Housekeeping. It's Francis. I feel kind of awkward snooping through people's rooms. <laughs> there's no one else here, remember? Yeah, that's true. Well, there's the one guy. Ah, let's shave. Starting to look a little scruffy. <laughs> Anybody in here? Looking for items and such that we might need. No, nope. nothing of importance in this bathroom. <clears throat> we should open doors a little quicker. Just another bed. Nothing important in here. Let's look at my map again. Okay, there's some stuff down here. Let's go down there. Check it out. Go up to the front desk. <coughs> Charge! That, room. that was my room. Oh, there she is. Polly. Polly. Oh, hi. Oh. Well then. That look important. Maybe I'm just supposed to leave. I have a feeling I'm just supposed to leave. <clears throat> so let's do that. Loading chocolate chip cookies. Good morning, Agent Morgan. Did you sleep well? Morning, George. Dreamland was quite nice. You do look well rested. Oh, I was up practically all night doing paperwork. Thomas helped me out so I was able to go home and get some sleep, but not enough. Diane got back into town late last night. We should give her a visit. Which means going to the art gallery, correct? <clears throat> she lives and works in the office there. So it's the only place to find her. The gallery is open from 10 to 1700. Time for some art appreciation. A cultural <laughs> activity in such a small countryside town. Amazing. Let's go, gang. It's that creepy smile again. The gallery is called Muses Gallery. The Muses were the nine daughters of the goddess of memory in Greek mythology. Ah, uh, it's just like Diane to name it that way. Is she that intelligent a woman? Um, uh, maybe. You'll see for yourself soon enough. <laughs> Did you see how Emily not like Diane very much. I sense that this Diane is not popular among other women. I can't wait to meet her. <laughs> the gallery is on the north side of town. Take the road along the lake and go north. Backing up. Charge. Well, I think I gotta get turned around. Can I go up this way? 
No, going the wrong way. Turn around, Morgan. Gotta go this way. There we go. An art gallery in such a small town. Am I prejudiced to think that it doesn't seem to fit? Greenvale and every small town has every right to enjoy art. That's right. Small towns tend to be full of highly cultured people. Although, I can't say I've ever been to the gallery myself. George, what about you? Are you into art? Actually, yes. I like going to the gallery. It's very relaxing there. Really, George? I never knew that about you for all this time. Emily, please. I'm just as cultured as everyone else. Some people <laughs> just have sides to them that you'd never expect. <sighs> By the way, about Diane of the gallery. Is she the type that isn't very... Appreciated by everyone. What do you mean? Exactly what it sounds like, Emily. Is she very attractive, especially to the opposite sex? So <laughs> you're asking if she's sexy, right? Well, she does always wear high heels. And definitely, it's uh, hard to explain. But that doesn't make me biased, okay? She just seems to, to look down on people. She always has. I just don't like people like that. That must be because sex appeal has no effect on you. Now that's out of line. I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't mean to poke fun at you. You just reacted so strongly to Diane's name. I did not. It, it's like you're suggesting I'm the total opposite of her. Is that it? Oh, Emily. That's not what anyone is suggesting. Let's just drop this conversation, okay? halfway and I have to go and jack another cop car pretty soon or you can just get gas yeah but there's only one gas station and I have no idea where it is it's much easier to just get another one I'm trying to make sure I'm going the right way just got to keep going up this road okay there any moment. Hill. Man, it wasn't fucking art gallery so far out. Everything's far away in this game. I wonder if Diane has anything to do with the murder. Diane moves on a whim and acts on impulse. We don't want her leaving town, so shut up and let's get to the gallery. <laughs> Shut the up! Did Emily say that and he and then George told her to shut up? I think so. That's interesting. <laughs> well, we made it. <laughs> Running into shit. Is there a, ah, there's a payphone over there. save before I go in there.